Binance tick, Crypto.com tick, Qcoin tick, OKX is also in the bag. When is Coinbase, Robinhood and all of the other exchanges going to come on board with Pepe? Well, we're going to take a look at it in this video and there's some very interesting things to take a look at when you look at exchanges and how they list certain coins, in particular Shiba Inu and Pepe. So if that's something you like, be sure to subscribe to the channel, give it a thumbs up if you are still holding your Pepe and let's get into it. So we'll take a quick look at the cryptocurrency market. It does feel like Pepe is single-handedly dragging the cryptocurrency market back up above 30k. So we see 1.22 trillion, the current market cap with Bitcoin holding there at 29,000 544. Now, when we come down the list, I'm not going to go through every coin here, but you can see Shiba Inu holding the 15th highest ranked cryptocurrency with a market cap of $5.8 billion with over 1.1 million holders on Shiba Inu holding there with six uh, five zeros nine nine five. Now, when we take a look at the 30, uh, excuse me, the 41st highest ranked cryptocurrency, we see Pepe now listed on Binance as well as some of those other big exchanges with a 100% increase on the day at 1.3 billion dollar market cap so what's kind of the view you know when are we going to see potentially some of these other listings now we know robin hood got it wrong with shiba inu at the time when shiba inu was really running hard robin hood didn't list it for whatever reason they chose not to and it was a big mistake they subsequently went back and did put that listing of Shiba Inu back on, probably about six months afterwards, and it didn't really work out. So will Robin Hood make the same mistake again? I don't think so. And right now, you know, however you want to look at Pepe Coin, there is massive volume going through it. There is huge opportunity to make a significant amount of money, whether you're an exchange, whether you're a spot trader, whether you're just holding, whether you're the average investor, it is all on the big exchanges. So you, if you're not on it, you're kind of missing out, I think is my view. Likewise with Coinbase. Now you can obviously buy Pepe with your Coinbase wallet. Now that isn't a, uh, it's not directly linked to the exchange. It is a decentralized um, wallet, non-custodial wallet that Coinbase do offer. And obviously it is on their platform. So from turning this to a tradable pair probably isn't the most difficult thing in the world. Now, the only place really to take a look at whether we're going to see this listing is obviously on Twitter. And if you go over to Coinbase Assets, this is where we see anything being listed. And you can see here that we're just seeing other coins right now. Pepe is not there. So if you're not following this Twitter account, I definitely recommend it because this is where we will see if Pepe is going to be listed on Coinbase. Now, I talked about this on my live stream a little bit, that I think Coinbase is probably one of those that will take a little bit of time. They'll want to make sure that both Binance, all these other exchanges are holding it. And then actually it is a solid coin with a significant amount of um, revenue being generated and at the same time a significant amount of floor price being put in there. Now what we can do is take a look at some interesting stats when it comes to whether Coinbase potentially would list it. Look at this holder growth 14.3% holder growth 105 thousand holders now again if you're thinking long term with pepe you gotta think shiba inu currently holding one point what excuse me nearly 1.3 million holders right now but actually this increase is slowed right down so this number here while ever we're above 10 percent, i think we're going to see significant moves up continually with Pepe. Now you can see some of these big exchanges. OKX up to 60, nearly $64 million. Binance, bear in mind this listed it earlier on today, currently sitting at $33 million. So as these start to build up again, in comparison, you've got Binance here with $468 million. Now again, it's all relative. With Shiba Inu being out for a long time, but again, OKX, Binance, the two biggest exchanges. Crypto.com down here and the 16th on SHIB. So there's definitely a really stark correlation between SHIB and Pepe in terms of their trajectory and kind of how it's all come about. So what's going on with the price? We saw that initial dump on the back of that uh, listing on Binance. Topped out earlier on today, though, four, five, six. Absolutely insane to think that that's a big price movement. Now, could Pepe lose a zero? Absolutely could, con you know, considerably lose a zero. And again, you might be thinking, how can you be so confident? Again, look at some of these top wallets. Look at what they hold in terms of Shiba Inu, 100 million, 100 million, 50 million, 40 million. You can compare that to Pepe, we're down at 9 million, 10 million, 20 million. And remember, some of these are blacklisted wallets, so they'll never be able to sell. So again, it's all relative. And 
again, as this moves up, as Pepe moves up with this significant number of new holders coming in, it's very feasible we'll see Pepe break another zero. I mean, the volume is there. The price action is still consistently really solid. We're holding above this 3.5 level, which I think is really important. We want to see this push back above the 3.9, hold that 3.9, and then we're on our journey into some new all-time highs. I think we could definitely be seeing the fives, the sixes, maybe as we come through the weekend, if both momentum continues. Now, a lot of people still think that Pepe could rogue. A lot of people still think, well, the hype will die down. Well, if you've got 14% of people getting into Pepe, whenever you've got significant volume trading through it, and whenever you've got exchanges holding 60, 70, 80 million dollars worth of volume, well, it's not going to walk away that quickly. Even when you look at the decks of some of the transactions coming through on the decks, you see some massive buys, and all of these are new holders coming to Pepe. So I think if anything, the FOMO is really just starting and Pepe could be one of those that we see it. Could we see a Coinbase listing? Could we see a Robinhood listing? And could we see a significant price pump on Pepe? I think all of those things could be sooner than you think. But let me know down below in the comments. What do you think? Is Coinbase coming soon? What do you think the prerequisites are? If Binance is listing it. I don't think Coinbase are going to be far behind. Remember, they delisted things like XRP because of volume right now. Pepe has a huge amount of volume, $2.3 billion. That's nothing to be sniffed at. So let me know in the comments down below. And if you want to see Pepe on Coinbase, smash the like button. I've heard it works. And also, if you aren't already, subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with what's going on in crypto and all of the latest with meme coins. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you at a $3 billion market cap. See you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.